The reason behind the inconsistent VFX in Marvel Studios' MCU projects has been revealed in a new report. Now running into its 14th year, the Marvel Cinematic Universe has been around since 2008's Iron Man from director Jon Favreau, led by franchise star Robert Downey Jr. The MCU has changed significantly over the years, becoming notably bigger in scale and developing a massive fan base all over the world. After the Infinity Saga, which culminated in Avengers. Endgame, Marvel Studios is showing no signs of slowing down. Now actively developing the MCU's Phase 4, 5, and 6, collectively known as the Multiverse Saga, Marvel Studios is releasing a string of exciting new projects in the coming years. Despite the franchise's continued success, however, the MCU has been plagued with persisting issues. One of them is the lack of visual language for the universe, with critics and audiences complaining that MCU movies and shows often look flat and dull. The MCU also has widely inconsistent CGI quality within its projects. The recent first She-Hulk, attorney at Lot Railer, for instance, received significant backlash for its poor effects when compared to the mostly lauded VFX work in Endgame and other Infinity Saga projects. A report from Gizmodo offers new insight regarding the Marvel's VFX work. The article features interviews from various VFX artists who have worked on Marvel projects, providing a glimpse into what it's like tackling an MCU movie or TV show. The franchise's inconsistent VFX appears to stem from Marvel's indecisiveness. Since the creative teams tend to go back and forth between options and make last-minute decisions, artists are forced to rush some scenes, causing a stark difference between shots. Read the related excerpt from the report below. Marvel Studios is known for its loose storytelling approach. Despite having a penchant for setting up long-term narratives, Marvel actually tends to be quite lenient in its creative decision-making within a project, welcoming ideas for both cast and crew. This was established in the original Iron Man movie, which was filmed without a completed script and featured plenty of improvisation. Later, Avengers Endgame famously reshot Iron Man's death just three months before its release because a new idea came up during post production. This creative freedom and flexibility is one of the reasons why many filmmakers like working with Marvel Studios. However, it's clear from the aforementioned report that there is also a downside to this, as indecisiveness and constant changes force VFX artists to work harder and to extremely tight deadlines. Ultimately, Marvel Studios will have to deal with this ongoing issue. As the multiverse saga continues, the studio needs talented VFX artists more than ever. Putting a strain on an already burned-out industry could backfire as the quality of new projects suffers. These issues are by no means exclusive to Marvel Studios, though, as all major filmmaking companies are guilty of creating challenging work environments, but with MCU being such an immensely popular franchise, Kevin Feige and his team can lead the way. Marvel can start by setting reasonable expectations and giving VFX artists proper compensation for their work on MCU projects, or their new movies and shows may continue to bear the brunt. Source, Gizmodo Key Release Dates Black Panther, Wakanda Forever, 2022, Release Date, 2022-11-11 Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania Release Date, 2023-02-17 Guardians of the Galaxy 3 Release Date, 2023-05-05 The Marvel's Captain Marvel 2, 2023, Release Date, 2023-07-28 Captain America, New World Order, 2024, Release Date, 2024-05-03 Marvel's Thunderbolts Release Date, 2024-07-26 Avengers, The Kang Dynasty, 2025, Release Date, 2025-05-02 Avengers, Secret Wars, 2025, Release Date, 2025-11-07.